Hey, hello, this is Carlos with another video, and um, this video is about this new game called Fantastic Four Frontier, right? So, I mean, it's not really a play to win game, although it does say some stuff like this, but, and you know me, I'm play to win all the time, but I like this because, okay, this is the game, and look, a couple of things, we're looking at, looking at the top right here. You can see it's, uh, it has a little um, um, south, north, east, west, east, west, right? That's pretty freaking cool. I mean, like you don't know what you, you do know what north, east, and west. So not a lot of games have this unless if they're they're in, uh, unless they have little radar. That's a pretty cool, neat thing. But what's amazing? Right, it's this building. Like, look at these build buildings. I know this is kind of like medieval or um, RPG kind of, but honestly, I have never seen anything like this. Okay, we're talking about, right? We're not just talking about these like house bricks, right? I mean, look at this. This combination. But what's really amazing to me is look at how many bricks there is. How many bricks? That's at least one, two, three, four, five. That's at least um that tree right there, right? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, eighteen. At least twenty, at least twenty-two uh, breaks on that. And you do this times right that times two, and then this thing probably has like over two hundred breaks, right? But I mean. And it's amazing by how many bricks they can put up without making it lag. But um, let's do a little exploring. I'm just amazing how many bricks they can put up without having any lag. Okay. The jump is high. So I'm gonna get tripped up. Oh, look at that. There's more trees. There's this guy. It's a huge. Also, something you might have already noticed. Yes, um, there's like a fog, right? When you enter a certain, like, look at this tree right there. Like, the tree behind it. This tree. You can't really see it until I walk up. Okay, now you see it clear. Now you, you don't really see it. There's like a fog within 30, 30 studs. It becomes, everything's really clear. And after another 20, everything's kind of foggy. And then another 10, it becomes, it disappears. Which... Struggle. You, you don't see it anymore, but once you get in the room, see it. That's another thing. And there is this. There is a now the screen GI. I'm not really sure. I haven't touched it yet. But it looks. Uh, it doesn't look. Hmm. Okay, this is kind of neat. Look. Okay, so. I'm gonna face something different. Huh. Oh, so that's that's neat. So what it does is what this does is it looks in front of your the camera goes in front of your person. Right? So if you wanna go behind this, that's a pretty cool thing. Neat thing they did there. Um but once you press A um WASD it doesn't move anywhere so you're, you're stuck until you press Q again and that's the armor now P alright P is real far P is sharp don't want that I um do this is see something okay press I again it disappears O uh, oh, I guess O is everything. Okay. Cute. So, I mean, that's cool. And there, um. I mean, this is just really neat. Let me just reset so I can go to the start. What I don't, I don't really like is the um, energy bar and the health bar. It's not very uh, big. 
I guess. Let me make this smaller so you can see it. Okay, so the health is 200. Alright, I press shift. You can see it. You can see it go, but then the thing is, it's kind of. Um, I don't know. The shift is is kind of glitchy. I mean, I know this is a better and everything, but I don't really like it. Um, because you can sprint, you can always sprint. Like I'm sprinting, I'm sprinting. This is what I mean by I don't like this stamina board. I'm sprinting. Okay, now it gains back up. I'm sprinting again. It's like the sprint is forever. There's no pause in it. If there is a delay and then there's a gain, then that's good. But I don't really like that. The health bar, uh, just in general, the health and the energy bar, I mean, they're good. The way they work is good. It's usually how most game works. But the energy bar, not really that great. But what I mean by it's not great is the way it's. Well, the way it operates, but other than that, it's just the way it looks. I don't really like the way it looks. I can't even see the number unless if I go up near to my own uh, my screen. But overall, this game is awesome. I mean, there's a quest you can do quests. All right, you can do quests. Talk to them. Hey there, need some help? Please don't mind the hair. Where we'll make money? They do here. Where can I find weapons and armor? How can I fish, hunt, find, hunt, or find collectibles? Oh, snap, there's lightning. Let's go, whatever. Okay, let me move. I just saw lightning. So my character looks like a girl. And it looks square. The only thing, yeah, like, other than that, I just don't like the. The way the character looks it looks very it looks blocky. There's no eyes. I mean, I know this is better and everything, but this is basically, basically, the way most things gonna look. And so, well, this guy got glasses, no mouth though. But I mean, overall, it's nice. It's a very nice game, and it's also shift locked. Which I don't like, because if you wanna, if you wanna, let's say if you want, you're shooting a bow, right? You have a bow, you're shooting an arrow. If you wanna aim straight, you have to go like that, you know. That's it. I'm aiming at this guy. So it's kind of like, let's see, look at that. So if I'm down here, if I'm up. If I'm up at a higher angle. I go like that. So if I'm at, if I'm like lower, I have to aim like that. Whereas, you know, when you go to classic and just hit them without actually uh, losing your if you would sight around you. But that just might be. Alright, but overall, this game is freaking amazing. Look at all this stuff. It looks like um, RuneScape, but Roblox style. No, can I make it? Yeah, I jumped too slow. Not, not high enough. Well, that's all I have for now. Peace out.